like the video and subscribe for this wonderful looking cookie. Hey yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to another video and in this video we are here back inside a build a boat once again and today we are going to be using only codes to completely beat build a boat for treasure. The codes that I'm going to be redeeming in this video are going to allow me to get anything I want inside of the game. We're going to be completing pretty much everything inside of the game with these codes so make sure I stay tuned and also like the video and subscribe and comment down below a challenge that I should do in the next video. And also if you guys do want to get a gift by me inside a build a boat make sure to go ahead and comment down below your roblox username and also make sure to like the video and subscribe and without further ado let's go ahead and make a brand new account and use these quests or use these codes to our advantage to beat everything inside of the game let's go ahead and do this all right so right now i am on a brand new build a boat account i only have 10 gold i have absolutely no tools and all i have is the menu pretty much and well you guys can see i have absolutely nothing but the codes that i'm about to redeem right now are gonna allow me to actually buy some things inside the shop and be able to actually beat every quest inside of the game so if you're a starter player inside a build a boat or you're a new player i'm about to show you guys how to basically complete the entirety of build a boat right now so let's not waste any more time i'm gonna go over to my settings and i'm gonna type in equal sign and then d just like this i'm just gonna redeem these quick codes off the start equal sign and then p i'm also going to put high as well i'm just literally going through these codes super super quickly so that way i could start doing more stuff here we're gonna type in squid army just like this we're gonna get uh 22 gold and also 22 snow blocks okay everything's looking good so far and there's still one more thing that i need to do i need to type in this code as well which is going to be chill 079 was here so i'm gonna type that code in i'm gonna get this item and this item is key success for what i'm about to show you guys here in just a second but now that we've actually made it this far now all i need to do is get three gold somehow now how am i gonna actually get three gold well all i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna place this right here all i have to do is literally just go inside of genuinely the first stage right here okay now all i have to do is just oof just like this and then boom you guys will see uh just like this we get ourselves eight gold which is plenty all right so now that i actually have that i am now able to beat build a boat and you guys are probably saying like what in the world what do you mean you're able to beat build a boat well check this out now if i go to my menu i'm gonna start the cloud quest right here now i get 100 gold and 25 balloons for completing this so what i'm actually gonna do is i'm gonna go inside the menu here i'm going to buy the hinge block and now that i actually have this this item that i bought with the gold that i got from the code and using this item that i got from the codes i'm now able to actually beat the game so here we go all i'm gonna do is make this little fly mechanism just like this and the cloud that i have to touch is all the way up there i'm just gonna start climbing up just like this hold space bar and all i have to do is just touch the cloud and as soon as i touch the cloud you guys will see here in a second what this is actually about to do and just like that we got it boom there we go all right so i just got 25 balloons the next quest right here is the target quest but all i have to do is literally just do the same exact thing once again and once we actually place that all we're gonna do is place a firework right here then the hinge block go like this and you guys can see just how overpowered this is now not only can i complete every single quest with this but then i can also just fly to the end as well so getting to the end is not a problem now we just got 200 gold so far so good we are doing very very well now what i'm going to do from here is i'm going to clear all once again i'm going to start up the next quest and the next quest is the soccer quest but there's only one problem this quest is actually super hard to do if you don't have some of the required materials i'm actually going to buy a harpoon for 200 gold and the reason why i'm gonna do this is just because i can you know move the ball super super easily although if i really wanted to i could also fly to a stage and get harpoons absolutely for free but i'm not gonna do that so what i'm actually gonna do is i have to attach this harpoon to myself now that i actually got the harpoon attached to me now all i have to do is just simply shoot the soccer ball just like this and then just reel in the harpoon and then i'm just gonna reset it and now you can see that the soccer ball actually has forward momentum so now it's gonna be way easier than trying to push the soccer soccer ball over and over again and with enough force if we can get it over this tiny little ledge that's gonna be the hard part come on soccer ball you got it get it in actually i think it's good i think it's, it'll go in so yeah there you guys go you can see just like that 300 gold and we also got a soccer ball now so now we're getting all these items and these quests are going by so easily now what i'm gonna do is go to my quest once again and i'm gonna do the ram quest it's gonna pay us 350 gold and also a lot of blocks super super easily keep in mind guys 
this. We're already at 405 gold. And also, it costs us 200 gold to buy the harpoon. So we basically have already made 600 gold. And we're about to get even more very, very easily. All right, so I'm going to go up here just like this. And well, if you guys didn't know, just with the same thing we've been doing all day long, we're just going to make the same flying mechanism. And we're just going to go right here. And we're going to go through the little hoop. Now, obviously, this is like kind of cheating the quest. But it's not cheating because it's a mechanic inside of the game. But you're supposed to build a boat and like try to like fly it on the ramp here. But if you guys just want to get the quest done with, just like that, boom, 350 gold. And we also just got 100. Oh my goodness. Yo, this is so, this is so easy, guys. Like this is so, all right, this one as well. We're about to get 450 gold just like this. Okay, so what I'm going to do for this one is I'm just going to go like this. All right, I bought that. Then we just have to build up here. And if you're actually on a brand new account, just like I am, it's okay. You're still able to actually get the, you're still able to like get this in high up locations and the reason and for that it's because we actually have ourselves some balloons here so all i gotta do is equip some balloons to my avatar it's going to allow me to jump a little bit higher all right i got that one right there nice and then one's gonna spawn over here i'm going to delete some of these just because now we got this one all right cool and now all i need to do is get the one on top of there i'm just gonna place some more balloons so i can get around the map super easily i'm going to start activating these other balloons that i just got and just like that we are flying it's just like having your own diy jetpack inside of the game it's actually super cool so then we're just gonna go like this and now all we have to do from here is just go all the way to the waterfall this is the only slow and painful parts but don't worry all we have to do is just use our little boat motor right here in our pilot seat and all we have to do is just fly on over the last spawn location which is just right across by these trees and now that i'm over here you guys could see i'm about to claim this right here this little find me like that and just like that i got 450 gold and also glue blocks as well and I can actually use these glue blocks to make a way better glitch. But while I'm over here, I might as well just go and grab... Oh my goodness, let's go ahead and grab another free item right there. Don't mind if I do. So we're already at 1,200 gold and we're not even done. The next quest that I do want to go over is the Thin Ice quest and also the dragon in the box. All right, a couple of these, actually a few of these are going to be quite difficult. But since we've actually got some gold on our hands, we can maybe make it just a little bit easier. I'm going to take a wild and investment here and i'm actually going to buy this pvp pack and the reason why i'm gonna do this is so that way i can actually defeat the dragon boss way easier because inside of this you guys can see all of these blocks that i'm gonna get right here uh, specifically these little pistols i'm going to be able to one shot the dragon because the dragon inside the dragon quest for some reason is a one tap to these items all right so literally all i'm gonna do is just stand on this little platform just like this and i'm just gonna try to shoot the dragon stand still please I beg you. Ow! Ow, ow, ow. If you get hit by one fireball, like, it's wraps. Like, you're dead. So, as soon as he stands still, I'm gonna try to hit him on stand still. Whoa! Right there. Boom. Just like that. Right there. 600 gold and 25 cannons just like that. Alright, so I actually did lose, like, 500 gold because I had to buy one of those packs, but look at all the stuff that we've actually completed here. So, now all we have to do is the Thin Ice and the Box Quest. And the Thin Ice is the world's hardest quest inside of the game because you only have 100 block limits, but you do get 1,000 gold. So, how in the world are we actually going to go and complete this quest? That is going to be the question. Well, guess what, guys? If we just go back to our regular, you know, strategies that we originally had, now we actually have a glue block, so it's going to be a little bit easier. All I got to do is go like this, press the launch button, and boom, I am now off. And I'm doing the Thin Ice quest just like this. It's literally, uh, it's literally a cheat code to the entire game. And plus, when you go through the stages, the glitch doesn't break at all. The game just detects it like you're just launching through the stage with a normal boat and you guys can see right here i am now at one of the final stages i almost oofed when i was going through just because the music stage was right above and now all i have to do is just go above the treasure chest and boom i'm going to complete the best quest inside of build a boat like literally just because we redeemed those codes at the beginning of the game and i got these items gave me the biggest advantage ever and that's why if you guys have not redeemed those codes yet you guys should go ahead and do so right away just like that i got a thousand gold 100 snow blocks and not only that but i also just got myself some free gold and also a gold block as well it's literally so easy oh also i got some treasure chests because i went through some stages so check this out guys i've only been playing the game
game for like less than 15 minutes doing all this stuff. And take a look at all the items I got. I got wood blocks. I got corner blocks. I got this. I got this. I got TNT. I got a soccer ball. I got chest. And I got multiple of these, by the way. I'm just placing down just the singular blocks. I got all of this stuff inside of the game just under 15 minutes of playing. And I'm not, I, I could get even more if I wanted to. This isn't even counting the hidden locations of items around the map. This is just simply from doing the quest stuff. Like, it's literally so easy. So if you guys do want to see more tips and tricks just like this, make sure to go ahead and like the video and subscribe, turn on that notification bell, and I'll see you guys inside the next one. Peace out and goodbye.